hi friends in this video you will see how to calculate the centroid of a composite shape this shape is given it is made of, of a semicircle a rectangle and then a triangle so dimensional are uh, dimensions are given in meter like height is 4 meter this is 3 meter this is 6 meter and the radius of the semicircle is 2 meter so for simplicity we have divided uh, these parts into 1 2 and 3 3 parts so if we draw a table for part 1 part 2 and part 3 and we will write area here then we will write the x coordinate of the centroid of individual part and then y coordinate y coordinate of the centroid of individual individual part so a1 area of the uh, semicircle is pi r square by 2 because pi r square is the area of the circle this is half circle so we will get pi r square by 2 so we will get 6.28 meter square so we will write 6.28 meter square then for part 2 part 2 is in a rectangle so a2 will be breadth into height so it will be breadth is 6 meter and height is 4 meter so 4 meter so this will be 24 meter square now we can see that for part 3 it is a rectangle right angle triangle so a3 will be half into breadth into height so it will become half into 3 into 4 so it will become 4 into 3 12 by 2 is equal to 6 meter square so we have found all areas differently and uh, we will write it here 6.28 meter square then 24 meter square then we have 6 meter square now suppose we assume that this is the origin so this will be x axis and this will be y axis so with respect to this axis what will be the centroid of this one this and these all three shapes so we will write with respect to origin the uh, centroid of this hemicircle will be 4 r upon 3 pi centroid of semicircle we know that it is 4 r upon 3 pi so we can write it uh, sorry so centroid of the semicircle is 4 r upon 3 pi you can uh, see this formula anywhere in any book and we see that this is opposite side of the x axis so it will be in negative x direction so we will use minus here now it will be 4 into 2 upon 3 pi so we can get 8 upon 3 pi it will come like 0.8 Four eight eight meter in negative. Now y1 will be simply y1 will be half of this because it is symmetrical about x axis. So y1 will be half of the diameter. So y1 is equal to 4 by 2 is equal to 2 meter. Now for this part, part number 2 x bar is equal to x1 is x2 is its centroid will be in the middle so this will be the x and this will be the y so x will be half of this 6 meter so x2 is equal to 6 by 2 is equal to 3 meter and uh, y2 is 4 by 2 so y2 is 4 by 2 is equal to 2 meter for a triangle for a triangle centroid is located at x by 3 and y by 3 from this point so if we calculate centroid of triangle from here then we have to add this distance so x3 will be 6 this 6 plus this is 3 divided by 3 so it will become 6 plus 1 
so this will become 6 plus 1 is equal to 7 and by 3 will be the uh, 1 by 3 of this height so 4 by 3 so it will become 1.33 now we will fill this data in this table so x1 is minus 0.8488 y1 is 2 x2 is 3 and uh, y2 is 2 x3 is 7 and y3 is 1.33 now we have a uh, formula for centroid of the composite set x bar is equal to a1 x1 a1 x1 plus a2 x2 plus a3 x3 divided by a1 plus a2 plus a3 now we can write all the formula uh, values from the table for why we have a1 y1 plus a2 y2 plus a3 y3 divided by a1 plus a2 plus a3 so we can put all the values from the table so x bar will become a1 is 6.28 into x1 is minus 0.8488 plus f a2 is uh, 24 into f2 is 3 plus a3 is 6 and x3 a2 a3 is 6 and x3 is 7 divided by a1 plus a2 plus a3 6.28 plus 24 plus 6 you can calculate this from the calculator and you will get x is equal to 2.995 Please calculate this from the calculator. Similarly, y bar will become a1 is 6.28 into y1 is uh, 2 plus a2 is 24 into y2 is 2 plus a3 is 6 into y3 is 1.33 divided by a1 plus a2 plus a3 6.28 plus 24 plus 6 it will become y bar will become uh, if you calculate from the calculator 1.890 meter so centroid of this composite shift x bar y bar will become 2.995 comma 1.890 this in meters hope you understand and this distance is from this point so 2.995 will become someone here someone here and uh, 1.890 will become someone here somewhere here so nearby this location the centroid of the composite set uh, composite set will be located hope you understand this Thanks for watching my video.